dude. Whoa, dude. Whoa, dude. Alright, let's Totally do balloon. Did you just poke me? I did. Alright, ready? What's up guys, welcome back. I'm Indy. I'm Lucy. And we are Vagabonds Vintage. And today, we're just doing a thrift haul with all of the recent stuff that I've thrifted. Thrifted. I said it right. I know you did. It's oh my graphic tee uh, with the yeah, 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 shit yeah, on the yeah, back. Yeah. yeah. Did no you swearing. say a bad no word? No swearing or we don't get ads and then we don't get paid. <laughs> so this one, sick Ghostbusters shirt. On the back it has like the detail of the Ghostbusting pack machine things that they have. I think it's really cool. This shop was thrifted in Rosebud. We were just driving and we saw uh, Salvo's then we like did a method, but did a U-turn because you know we can't w go past an op shop without buying something. And this belt I thrifted at Campbell Market, and I just thought that it was super modern and cool. And then like you got it, I got it for uh, two dollars, so that was pretty awesome. And then these jeans, which I'll stand up in later, are flares, and I thought they were super 80s and really cool. Pretty sure they're male. Are they? Yeah, because the pockets at the back are so far apart. Oh yeah, I think, yeah, I'm pretty sure they were male jeans, but then someone took the ass in, so that... Bad wear. That's not that bad. But still. Okay. Okay, so this is one of the shirts that I have recently thrifted. It's got a massive collar, which kind of like reminds me sort of of like a sailorish kind of uniform. If you wear it up, you look like a vampire. Yeah. We have recently discovered. Um, it's cropped. I think it looks really nice if you don't wear anything underneath it. It is supposed to be like a cardigan, cardigan jacket throwover type thing, but I think it looks really cute if you don't wear anything underneath and you just wear it as like a cropped shirt. It's quite warm and it's like sort of like modestly cropped, not like this shirt, which is like it's it's a lot looser. Yeah, and um, it's good with high waist. Yeah, and it's really, it's something different because of the big collar and the kind of detail. It's pretty unique. I've, we haven't really seen very many um, clothes, jumpers like this. Yeah. With this cardigan I recently found, um, I think it was at Salvo's. Everyone's kind of wearing cardigans as just like shirts and not doing the buttons up all the way, like only doing some of them up. Yeah, but I think it's a really cool trend. Yeah, it's a really yeah. cute idea. It's like kind of the same go with that. Yeah. But this one is three quarter length sleeves and kind of more tight fitting. And you can make it more modest by doing more buttons up, obviously, or wearing something underneath it. You can tuck it in, which I thought looked pretty all right, or leave it out and undo some of the buttons. So, so here we have some really cute knit jumper sweater thing. The one I'm wearing definitely belonged to a grandma before but I think it's really cute. I love the neckline and the colours really nice. It's actually in really great condition. It's super cute. Mm, and I really like it. It's sort of like short and nice. Yeah. Uh, mine is a just a knit jumper like kind of cute and comfy. Uh, long, long sleeves all the way but then cropped with sort of like a train at the back-ish sort of thing happening there. Uneven. So, here we, I thrifted a chunky knit. It's from Supre, but I thrifted it. It's so warm. Yeah, I couldn't leave it behind because it's like the comfiest thing ever. But I'm not sure about like wearing it out for me. Yeah, no, I just wear it inside. I do definitely look like a mom. Yeah, and for me, because my shoulders are already quite broad, um, with this, it's so like chunky that it broadens my shoulders even more so and I really look like a man. <laughs> but so well, Lucy's just putting on a different shirt. I was going to talk about this really cute shirt that I thrifted at the Camberwell Market again. It's a really nice light but greyish kind of pink and I thought that it's kind of like some of that Asian soft girl aesthetic because it's a jumper but it's cropped and then it's got these nice big sleeves. And I just thought that it's like really awesome. Some, um, some holy shirts. <laughs> this jumper I found, both of these actually, I found at Campbell Market. Very nice, good for running. <laughs> it's really breezy. Like as soon as I put it on, I was like, whoa, it's cold. Yeah, it's like ventilation all over. Same with this shirt, same goes. You could wear it with a pair of jeans or like we can layer things with it. Yeah, with like, like overalls or. 
So this shirt, it's a little big on me around like the sleeves. Go, go. Because um, I actually originally thrifted it for my brother and then he wore it to footy because he liked it so much. And then um, he got tackled and the shirt ripped a big hole right through the middle. So we just decided to kind of unevenly cut it um, and it's kind of turned out like sort of grungy, like a nice cropped grungy uh, graphic t-shirt. Cute. This shirt, it's really cool um, graphic tee also. It says sick boy. It's actually from a barber's shop, but we bought it at the Camberwell market. And yeah. I, I think it's really cool. I think it looks really nice tucked into a pair of jeans. It's um, another holy shirt, like the ones before. Um, it's it, more lacy though. Yeah, this, this one's made out of lace. It says, vibe. And I really like also the um, detail on the sleeves. Makes it kind of retro-y, sort of sporty, sporty. I think it would look really nice layered with something. And it, I thought that it looked pretty good tucked into a pair of jeans. Sort of casual, but then sort of like makes your outfit that little bit more extra. This one, really nice. You'd want to layer it with things. Really nice turtleneck. I, the length of the sleeves is really nice. It's uh, it's really comfy material. I think also with it, with um, that, because it's a turtleneck and it's nice and plain, it's really nice for layering jewellery and uh, chains and stuff on top of. <laughs> oh! Do you just... Wait, wait, wait. We're off centre. Come this way. Okay, so I found both of these shirts again at Campbell Market. They're nice and flowy materials. Very summery. This one's a wrap shirt, so I'll just talk about this one. Um, so this one's kind of like those dance shirts that you see that are like wrap around, except it's kind of made out of a different material. I thought it was really nice because the sleeves are short and like they kind of flare out at the end. And then you can tie it up at the back like this. This one is really cute. Very um, summery, floral, I'd love to take this to the bee. I've recently also thrifted some male t-shirts. We've got my brother, Lucy's brother and a friend to model these shirts for us. This shirt uh, <laughs> comes me in all kinds of situations. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever I go to the bar, Grab another one, I always give it to the girl, and she's always <laughs> complimenting your Yeah, shirt. complimenting my new shirt. <laughs> what color? Is it, is it even blue or is it grey? I don't know, I'm cold one. <laughs> 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 good point. Blue or is it grey? It's a good build one because that's good. All Just right. say it's well, a, a bluey grey. It's a bluey grey. <laughs> and so, sure. Where, would, yeah. you wear, where <laughs> would you wear it to? Like, uh, going out, maybe a bar. You can't go to bars! He went to a bar. Uh, when I go to the pub with the boys after school, I always <laughs> rock this shirt because, you know, it just helps and uh, sets the mood. Um, oh yeah, well, this shirt is, uh, is blue. It's, um, it's a shirt. <laughs> it's got a collar. Uh, yeah, I wear this shirt like all the time, yeah, when I'm with my boys going to the bar. <laughs> okay, so that's all for today's video. Thanks for watching. Do you want to say the uh -huh. subscribe? Subscribe down below. Uh, comment? Comment? Okay, 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 okay. Leave a like and comment and subscribe. Mm -hmm. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe down below. Follow us on our Instagram page at Vagabonds Vintage. Bye! Bye!